We live in a distracted and busy society. The world bombards us with a host of competing voices and conflicting messages. With so many voices and different messages, all we hear is just noise. We're left with little room for the voice of God in our lives. We've lost track of his message for us. We no longer know his word. God's voice in sacred scripture is clear. It's peaceful. It's strong and consistent. His message is powerful. A tremendous, breathtaking reality is right before us. God speaks to his people. The Denver Catholic Biblical School is the lay division of St. John Vianney Theological Seminary. We were founded over 30 years ago as a response to the Second Vatican Council's call for the Christian faithful to read, study, and pray the Word of God. Our mission is to teach the scriptures from the heart of the church's tradition and put people in contact with the person of Jesus Christ. In our four-year program, we go through all the books of the Bible. Our hope is that throughout this journey, our students will have a personal encounter with the Word of God. In the biblical school, we go through the 73 books of the Bible. That's what we do. But when you start to study and pray and read the scriptures, something truly supernatural begins to occur. The Bible begins to go through you. And that's what God does. Pope Francis recently put it this way, God's word is unpredictable in its power. First of all, we are the Catholic biblical school. The scripture is taught as a gift given to us by the church. As the Denver Catholic Biblical School, we're not here giving you our own interpretation of the scriptures. We're trying to enter into the last 2,000 years of how the Catholic Church has always understood the scriptures. What did the early church fathers, people like Augustine, St. Thomas Aquinas, St. Catherine of Siena, all the saints, the popes, the councils, we want to enter into the last 2,000 years of Catholic interpretation of the Word of God. The Word of God is really a text that is alive. It may seem like it's an ancient text, but it doesn't matter how many times you encounter it, how many times you read over the same book or the same lesson, that it is really a different encounter based on where you're at in your life and the Spirit continuing to talk to you in the circumstances of your life. Our curriculum is designed to present the big picture story of the Bible. What we want to do with a systematic, coherent study of the Bible is to not just give you individual books, but we want to give you the big picture of how does everything relate all the way from Genesis to Revelation. The problem is that people don't know how to read scripture. They start reading and they have very good intentions. They start in the beginning of the year and they start reading all of those great stories that we see in Genesis and Exodus. And then they get to Leviticus and they've lost the story. I kept buying new Bibles thinking that if I bought a different Bible it'd be easier to read and, and I realized that I needed someone to help guide me through it. The biblical school made it all fit together. I knew a lot of stories about the Bible but I didn't know how they connected and that's what has helped me not only understand my faith but giving me the tools to explain it to others. We study the Word of God together in a prayerful and transformational way. When you get that aha moment, especially for yourself, it's one thing, but when you see a room full of students and all of a sudden you see them start to nod and go, right, okay, now I get that. It's not about knowing something, it's about knowing someone. They're encountering Christ in a deeper way. So every time I left class, I, I thought of the disciples on the road to Emmaus who said, uh, weren't our hearts burning within us when he opened up the scriptures to us? It became a, a deeper relationship and falling in love with Christ on a, in a deeper sense. Like St. Jerome said, ignorance of scripture is ignorance of Christ. In Matthew, you read, you know, by their fruits you shall know them. And I have seen that in my parish. As I said, not only in how involved the students have become in the parish, but how it has made a change in their lives. It awakens that hunger and that thirst, and then you want to go and share it with others. Like uh, St. James says, we're not supposed to be hearers of the word only, but doers. The only regret is that I didn't take the course 20 years earlier. I think it would have helped us raise our kids better. I think uh, the foundation of my business world would have been better. It was like putting a real solid foundation finally into my life. When people consider the four-year commitment, it might seem like something you can't do, but I would suggest that people just take it one year at a time. The commitment that you put into the biblical school is a life-giving commitment. Sometimes we have students come to us 
who know all the mechanics, the technicalities of Catholicism, but they don't know why. They don't know why the church teaches what it teaches. They don't know why we believe what we believe. And now it all comes together and starts to make sense for them for the first time in their lives. You're about to read the greatest love story that's ever been written. God's word is incredibly powerful. So we read in Genesis, God speaks and things come into being. He creates everything out of nothing by the power of his word. So when I read and prayerfully digest the word of God, God is speaking to me. He's speaking to you in the power of his Holy Spirit. There are illustrations of this all over the Bible. For example, when Jesus said to Lazarus, the man who had been dead in the tomb for four days, it says that he cried out in a loud voice and said, Lazarus, come forth. And then it says, the dead man came out. This is the same thing that happens to us when we hear the voice of God in our lives. We are awakened to new life, to the life that Jesus offers us. Pope Francis recently said, the study of the sacred scriptures must be a door open to every believer. This door is open to us in the Catholic Biblical School. We invite you to walk through this door and join the thousands who have begun this journey of hearing God's word in their lives.